made it to the last stage of getting the girl. It all comes down to this moment. So get your game face on, because this Valentine's Day, we talking about the first date. Get ready, because this ain't going to be pretty. Rule 245, the first date. This is it. This is the moment you've been waiting for. All the waiting, all the planning was for this moment, all right? Successfully complete this, and you never have to worry about getting the girl again. Uh, unless you break up. Now, pay attention to this next part, because this is vital to you. Once you're on the first date, you have one chance, one chance, one chance to get it right. Because if you mess up on the first date, there will not be a second. The first date should happen within 10 days of getting her number. Because if it ain't happen by then, it ain't gonna happen. And don't call her the same day you get her number. That's a common, common rookie mistake. One more thing. If it's been like three or four days since you got her number, and you ain't called her yet, go into your phone, scroll down to her phone number, and delete it. Just delete it. And for the 10 day breakdown, we have got Off The Chain. This is Off The Chain for the 10 day breakdown. Listen up maggots, day zero, get out the number. Day one, don't call her. Day two, don't call her. Day three, she's wondering why you haven't called her yet. You need to call her. Day four, drop her a text. Day five, here's where you get to know about her personality, her schedule, so you know where the first date should be. Day six, don't call her. Day seven, arrange the first date. Day eight, cover your bases. No movies are showing. Buy the clothes from McDonald's. If you got coupons, bring them with you. And if your friends suffer from dickheadism, they take her as far away from the area as affordable. Day 9 slash 10, this is date day, this is date day, unless you've already had it, and if so, good job! Everything you've learned about her has been revision, and now it's a practical exam! Good luck, you need it! I'm off the chain! Back to you, Dolly Boy! Now, the reason the first date is so important is this. You and her, you get to see if you enjoy each other's company. This basis is the pillar that supports the relationship that you want to have. A leading reason why a lot of relationships break down and crumble is because that pillar was never created in the first place. With that pillar supporting your relationship, you have more of a chance of it lasting longer than about two weeks. You people know who you are. Okay, now apparently it's tradition for a guy to pay for a girl on the first date. Hmm, you know, at one time it was tradition for a guy to see a girl that he likes, beat over the head with a club, and drag her back to his cave. But times have changed. Now, if you want to pay for her on the first date, then by all means, be my guest. But any girl that expects the guy to pay on the first date in this day and age of credit crunch clearly has no conscience whatsoever. But if that's what you like, then by all means, do what you do, live how you live. Now for the touching analysis, we have Mighty Chain. Mighty? Oh, we live here. Oh, oh. Thank you, Jelly Boy. <laughs> yes, ladies and gentlemen, mainly for the guys, I'm Tia Mighty, also known as Mighty Chain. I'm going to be showing you things like the safety spots. Because on your first date, you cannot touch places such as the danger zones. Now, safety spots. These places are places where you can touch without getting in trouble, such as the shoulder, the forearm, just up at the top of the back. Nowhere else, unless she touches your hand. If she touches your hand first, then you can touch her hand. 
because she's hinting she likes you. Now danger zones. These are for all the guys that think that fatty, booty, ass is all good to grab on the first date. It ain't! And I tell you that from personal experiences. Okay? Other places. The chest. Boobies. Titties. Whatever you may call them. This is not cool. Neither is her poom poom. Also known as her vagina. Her lady garden. Down south. Please. Do not touch these areas. They are not for you. Yet. Back to you, Duddy Boy, in the studio. Thank you, Mighty Chain. Now, in regards to touching, if she touches you and you don't react at all, you're going to look like an idiot straight up and down. Okay? Now, if she touches you, touch in return. This doesn't mean if she touches your arm, you grab her booty. No. That's not what it means. If she touches your arm, you can touch her arm, okay? This is called going with the flow. Because she's not going to touch you anywhere that she doesn't want to be touched. Go with the flow. Now, this is determined by the success of the date itself. If your date's drawing to a close and it's been going really good and right before you part your separate ways, you're just staring into each other's eyes. That moment can only last for three seconds. Because after three seconds, that romantic moment will become real awkward. And that's the worst way to end the date. Don't let your last first date determine how your next one will be. This is where all girls are different. Some girls kiss on the first date. Some girls do not. It's up to you to figure out which one you got. So use your eyes. Don't generalize. And above everything else, be yourself and enjoy it. Now, I want to thank you guys, girls, everybody out there for supporting the guide, watching the guide, everybody on Facebook, YouTube, MySpace, Bebo, wherever you're watching this at. Thank you guys for all of your support. And good guys out there, after you've done this, your quest to get the girl will be over. But your quest to keep the girl will just be beginning. Keep a lookout for the Good Guys Guide to Keep the Girl and more Deli Boy production sketches. Um, if you want to get at me, holler at me on Facebook, Deli the Boy, B L I D comma B O Y, or get at me on my email address, Deli Boy Productions at live.co.uk. Everybody, have a happy Valentine's Day from the Deli Boy, everybody in the Deli Boy crew, Saint, Phipps. Mighty, Mikkel, Stephanie, Jacqueline, other Stephanie. Keep a lookout for all of us. The profiles are coming really soon. Have a happy Valentine's Day and peace.